escape from everything happening, but it's just there's me in the face. You know, a friend of mine always said that uh, smart girls read books and bimbos watch reality TV shows. I think that's harsh, but smart girls do read books. Okay, so um, this is one of the greatest literature works that's come from this country. Are you interested? It's Things Fall Apart by Chino Achebe. Okay, let's, uh, let's dive in. It's nice being outside, right? Like the fresh air. It's not every time we stay indoors with the ACs on, you know, it's healthier this way. That's why I once said us to read it outside. Okay. So... <clears throat> Part one. I really like Shakespeare for you. Part one. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Okonkwo was well known throughout the nine villages and even beyond. So Okonkwo was a very famous guy. He was known all over the place throughout the nine villages, you know? Imagine if we lived like in these times where it's villages and we didn't have AC, you know, <laughs> we'll be sleeping and sweating. Laura, look at me. Okay. Um, his fame rested on solid personal achievements. So he achieved a lot of stuff. Like he's a, he's a man of, you know, esteem and stuff. I shall go water for you, or, or, or juice. Do you want water or juice? Or both? I'll get both. Tony, Tony! Juice and water is okay, right? You can just nod if it's yes. Strong, trying to be the man, but 
Everybody still stares me in the face. I'm trying to be strong, I'm trying to be the man, but I'm losing my mind. I try to escape from everything happening, but it still stares me in the face. But it still stares me in the face. I try to be strong, I'm trying to be the man, but I'm losing my mind. I try to escape from everything happening, but it still stares me in. to work out okay you see how i'm driving you around now in a few months you'll be walking you'll be running i'll get you a car you'll be driving the car around with your friends baby And I'll do anything for you, okay? Anything you want, you tell me it's done already. Before you say it, it's done, okay? So do you want to go to an amusement park? Or maybe ice cream? Or both? I'll do both. It's, it's not a problem. Look at me, babe. Bro, <clears throat> my man. Finish talking to yourself, man. Okay? <sighs> That's good. Laura, how are you? Mm. How is she? She's a strong lady. Mm. And how are you holding up? Fred, hmm. so how are you holding up? Yeah, I'm good. I'm fine. Come on, I mean, you don't look fine to me at all. Don't judge a book by the cover. That's what they say, right? I'm fine. Right, this is not what being fine looks like now. You know what I think? I think you need a breath of fresh air. That would do you a lot of good. Well, I'm literally outside mm. with my daughter. We were doing the routine. It's part of a therapy. There's plenty of fresh air here. <laughs> Can't you feel it? <laughs> Bird, don't play dumb with me now. Come on, you know what I mean. Hmm? Come on. I think she wants to take it now. Mm. We can talk inside, okay? No problem. Help me with her legs on right there, okay? Oh, all right, all right, no problem. I'll do that. I mean, her feet. Oh, okay. Yeah. Fred, when last did you go to the office? Oh, no, I'll be going to the office very soon. Don't worry about it. I'll be going. 
That will make me very happy. At least it will help take your mind off this current situation. And you won't come to the bar with me. And yet you are here drowning yourself in alcohol. This is more than what you take normally now. <sighs> what are you trying to do? I beg, I beg. Don't be dramatic. Don't you are dramatic. slowly becoming a drunk. What are you talking about? I'm not who's a drunk here. Yeah. I'm not a drunk, bro. You have had enough for today. What do you mean I've had enough, bro? I'm not. You have had enough for today. Bro, I'm killing pain. And please, I need you to go upstairs and dress up. You are going out with me. You need a change of environment, okay? I'm not a drunk. It's a difference. I'm killing pain. Okay, welcome to my world. Bro, well, you've had enough for today. Just give me the bottle. No. And so I, I said you're going out with me. So you I forgot with you to drink. Yeah, not to drink. You need a change of What do you mean not to drink? You won't give me my bottle. So when I go out with you, I won't drink as well. Bro, I talked about fresh air outside now. I guess, I mean, a change of... No, I'll, no, I'll, I'll go out with you. It has to be later on in the day, okay? I need to make sure that... that Laura is okay. That's fine. That's fine. Go to the bar, wherever you want to go. I better give me my bus, bro. I am not giving this to you. What are you talking about now? Why can't you come to my house and be giving me hey, order? Now. Mm. That's enough. You've had enough. How is it enough? enough? This is the only the second... Um, the first bottle today. Don't even try. It's the first bottle I'm drinking today. I said I will not give it to you. So how is that going to work now? Well, that's your business. It's my business. It's my house. It's my drink. Bro, I'm not giving this drink to you. This guy said to do overdue. You won't spoil it. Okay. So I sent Tony this recipe I found on Google. It's really nice. Do you want to try it? It's new. It's Italian, like the recipe. We can start with the chicken, though. But the chicken is like the light at the end of the tunnel when you're eating. Do you get me? So you just eat this, and then we go. To... OK, OK, OK. Let's do chicken. Let's do light at the end of the tunnel. It's cool. I should probably use a knife, but I have a technique. See that? You just spin it like a crocodile. <laughs> just want to try it? Um, you're not hungry. Drawing water or juice. Which one do you want? Just you pick this or this. This juice. Great. Great. Everything is going to be okay. I promise you. I promise.
人生。用这个什么Not again. <sighs> okay, um, Laura, listen, Daddy will be fine. Okay, he just needs some rest. Okay, all right. You know what? Let me just take you outside. Okay. Tony, how are you? Very well. We are fine. Laura, I bought you ice cream. Mm. Okay, uh, Tony, just take this, okay? Just please, just try to feed her, okay? Okay. I'll Let wait. me see him. Huh? All right. All right. Wow. Laura, he got ice cream for you. Still waiting for you. Look, everything is okay. Oh boy! Oh, the lights. There's so many lights on. Fred. Fred, I'm really disappointed in you. You got drunk and passed out right in front of your daughter. Laura saw me. I didn't know she saw me. I didn't know she was there. I didn't know she was. I don't want her to see me like. Is she okay? Don't yeah. worry. Right. Don't worry. She's fine. Tony helped put her to sleep. 
Well, let me ask you. When did you start smoking? Huh? I mean, you of all people, you are that one person that always campaign against smoking. How could you have been so reckless? You are supposed to be looking out for her, taking good care of her. How did you think she felt seeing you in that state? It was a mistake. It won't happen again. It won't happen again. Okay, that's my word, and I stand on it. Okay, thing is that like, what, 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 what happened? Huh? Eh? Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. If not for Tony that called me, only God knows what would have happened. Come on now. It's been almost six months already, and you're still here, all, 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 all backed up. That's the thing. It's been that long and she just got out of her coma like two months ago and she still can't do much. She can't walk. She doesn't even talk to me and I can't help her. We don't communicate. I'm trying to talk to her. I'm trying to talk to her, but she's not saying anything to me. And it's just, and it kills me every time I see her in that wheelchair. Honestly, it just reminds me of everything. And I don't know. I can't help her. That's the biggest thing. I can't do anything about it. And it's just, I know how you feel. I don't know how I feel. I know how I feel. Don't ever say you know how I feel. This is somebody I should be making life easy for, and she's going through extreme hardship. I can't do anything about it. And you know how I feel. How could you? How could you possibly know how I feel? Okay. Okay. Let's say I do not know how you feel. But how does getting drunk and passing out in front of her help her? Eh? You are only adding more to her pains. Fred, I have been advising you for a while now. Come out with me. You need a change of environment. I said, go to the office. You refused to go. Come out to the bar with me. You refused. Bro, you can decide on where to go. If you don't want to go to the office or go to the or, 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 or come to the bar, at least just, just go out. You can go to the park, to the cinema, anywhere. I just need you to leave this house and have a change of environment, that's all. It will help you. I know you're trying to help. I know you. I'm sorry, bro. I'm sorry I talked to you like that. I <laughs> fucked out. I'm sorry. I apologize. You know, I'm sorry. Thank you for everything, bro. Honestly. I'll go to the office tomorrow. You promise? Yeah, no, I'll go for a few hours. You know, I'll, I have to, you know, it's irresponsible that I haven't been going. I'll go for a few hours and then I'll meet you at, um, Meet you wherever after. All right. All right. But well, you have to actually come out tomorrow. No. Promise me you will come out. Bro, I'm coming out tomorrow. All right, that's fine then. I would have to take my leave. Thank I you. just came to make sure you're fine. Thank you, bro. All right. Ah. Oh, the room is strong, man. <laughs> Thank you, bro. I really right. appreciate everything. Tomorrow. I bet off one lights, off one lights. Help me off one life. This guy, Seth. Oh, Tony. To Tony. Yeah. Tony. Boss. Oh, you're making me shout on you. Why now? Why are you making me shout on you? You don't have a bad hangover. I'm sorry, boss. How's Laura? She's fine. In her room. Get the car ready, okay? Just wash it. I'm going to the office tomorrow. Okay, sir. I will do just that. Thank you. Okay. For taking care of Laura. <laughs> it's nothing. <laughs> All right, I'll be. Okay. All right, Please give me water. Water. Water, eh? Okay, sir. Room temperature. Okay, sir. And off like. Oh.
Good morning, boss. Tony. Good morning. How was your night? It was good, boss. Oh, please, there is something I want to tell you. Yeah, no, you can tell me anything, boss. So just don't advise me. Hmm? Don't advise me. Go ahead, say what you want to say. All right, boss. Oh, please don't take it as an advice. But it's just that I... I <sighs> just that you, you, you was. Just say what you want to say. What are you talking about? Okay, boss. This your new habit of drinking and smoking is very bad. And drinking and smoking doesn't take people's problems away. Well, I'm different. See, my case is different. Pain. Painkiller. My case is unique. I'm a unicorn. You know, unicorn, that horse that has that. That's me. Ah. Let me go upstairs and take up on Laura. Yes, please do. After you finish, bring me my cigar. Don't forget the cigar. Hi. Hi. I'm Jesse. Oh, Jesse. Yeah. You're welcome. Thank you. Yeah, my boss told me that you will be coming. Oh, okay. All right, come with me. Okay. This is Nurse Jesse. Laura, Nurse Jesse here is here to help you and take care of you and also to assist you in your routine therapies and other exercises. Laura, <laughs> a minute, please, I'm coming back. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon. Honey. Honey. She's from the hospital. Okay? They sent her here to come take care of you so you get better. Exactly. I came to help with your healing process. And also help you with your therapy sections. She's not like the other girls. Okay? She's officials from the hospital and she's here to make you walk again so you can run you know jog in the morning once get you a car it's no please 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 for me would you do it for me no Laura, I feel your pain. I feel your pain because I have been through pain. I have felt pain. 
when I was 10 years old, I lost my parents in a ghastly motor accident. I suffered to take care of my siblings. I hugged pure water. I hugged bread. I hugged biscuit. Just name it. I had to take care of my siblings. We slept under the bridge. All alone. I was, I was literally a mother to them. I just couldn't take care of myself because I had my siblings to take care of. Growing up wasn't easy for me. It wasn't. The responsibility was just too high. At the same time, I had to see myself through school. I had so many issues. I had so many obstacles. I really cannot say everything right now, but I saw hell. I grew up without having this motherly love. I had to put myself together and be the mother to my siblings. So I know, I know and I feel your pain. You have your dad here. You live in a very comfortable apartment. Okay? I had no one to care for me. No uncle, no auntie. No mother, no father. I struggled. I struggled, I fought. I didn't, I didn't let it to break me. So Laura, I'm telling you now to please let me help you. Trust me so I can help you. So this is not the end of the world. Okay? If I can be able to come out from my situation and become a nurse today, you too, you can make it back on your feet. And be happy. With your dad, he has promised to buy you a car, he has promised to get you gifts. Yeah. I didn't have such opportunity. Nobody promised me anything. So please, let me help you. Okay? Please. Is that a nod? That's a nod. That's a yes. High five. Whoa! You didn't record that. You should have recorded that now. She's smiling. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Where do we start from? Have you eaten? Have you had your bath? Okay, tell me, what do you want to eat? Trust me, you like my food. I can make any type of meal you want, but local and continental, so what do you want? What do you want to eat? Hmm? Or you want us to, you want to shower first? You want to shower first? Okay then, let me get my shoes off. So, we... really happened? I mean, exactly what happened? Um, her mother was uh, bringing her back from school. 
and the lorry hit them. She's a very careful driver, you know. She's not reckless like me. Ah, she. We lost her on the spot. And Laura became a paraplegic. And she hasn't been talking since then, so it's very difficult for me to communicate with her, you know? It's very difficult. Wow. It's very difficult because I can't even talk to her. I don't know what she's going through. I don't know what she's feeling. I don't know anything. I'm just guessing. Really sad. Don't worry, she'll be fine. I'm positive she will be fine. I mean, I'll do my best. I'll do my very best to make sure she's back on her feet again. We know everything is in the hands of God, but I'll do my best and leave the rest for God. I would appreciate that. Thank you. It's fine. She seems to like you. <laughs> Let's not be too sure yet. No, she likes you. And I like her too. <laughs> She's so beautiful. Okay, so I have to be on my way now. Thank you for everything. Oh, it's okay. And you be strong for her, okay? Yeah, no, don't worry about me. <laughs> okay, bye-bye. Take care. Tony. How are you? I'm fine. Mm. What about uh, Fred and Laura? I hope they are doing good too. Not any better. Mm. And they did not come here today? Yeah, she did. Oh, okay. Is Fred inside? Fred was actually supposed to go to the office today. Okay, okay, yeah. But then he ended up on a different cloud. I mean, you need to see his level today. I just hope that young man doesn't hurt himself. I press so too. No problem. Just get back to work, okay? Let me see him. All right. Laura, how are you? How's your daddy? Laura, all right, let me see your dad inside, okay?
so man how about you die <sighs> just um just justin i'm killing pain You can't separate me from my only source of happiness. Mm. My wife is gone. My daughter is barely here. She can't talk. She can't walk. I don't know what she's going through. This makes me happy for the moment. Well, that's a lie. That's a big lie, you know it. This cannot be your only source of happiness. Never. What else? What sort of source do I have? Fred, we talked about this. And you promised me that you would stop drinking and smoking. I mean, this cannot help the coming situation. Why does everybody keep saying that? Did you have a conversation with Tony or something? Listen, I'm facing my pain, okay? Just allow me to do that. This is not the way to face your pain. And you know it. You're only killing yourself. What difference does it make? My wife is gone. My daughter is... It's mine. Not here. If I'm gone, it wouldn't make any difference. Let me tell you what you're doing to yourself. Do you know what you're doing to yourself? Killing pain. You are only subjecting yourself to emotional torture. Fred, you need to be there for Laura now. I mean, she needs you now more than ever. Huh? I know. And what happened today? I mean, you promised that you would go to work and come by the bar. And you did not. What happened? If I go to the bar, this is the same drink I'll have. <laughs> okay. Uh, and I'll start work tomorrow. Fred, mm. don't play games with me. I'm playing games. You, Come on now. You know the exact reason why I asked you to come out. I asked you to go out so you can clear your head. And what, 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 what are you talking about? This helps me clear my head. <laughs> and it's cheaper when I drink it at home. So actually, I'm saving money. All right. I got us some juice. You know, when I was in school, like primary school, the teacher used to say that it was pronounced juice, not juice. I would argue all day. She's like, no, it's juice. I know it's juice. Like my mom calls it juice. It's juice. Do you want some juice? Okay, don't want juice. You must want some. Would argue all the time. So do you want some juice? It's your favorite though. And it's cold. I could get ice. Do you like the movie? That guy is really funny. He's a funny man. I think his name is like Nelson or something. I can't remember. Is that Kevin Hart? That's Kevin Hart in the middle, in the back. It must be a funny movie if Kevin Hart is in it. You don't want to do? All right. Hey, bro. Okay. Laura. How is she? It's difficult, man. I mean, she's not talking. She's not smiling she's not responding in any way like i need to communicate with her i need to know what she's going through and i don't i can't i just it's difficult don't worry 
I know there will be improvements soon, okay? Right. You know you need to take care of yourself as well. I'm trying. I'm trying. It's difficult. You know, seeing her in this... Seeing her in this wheelchair is just not what I want to see. You know, it reminds me that the love of my life is gone. Still can't believe it. I understand. But you know what I think? I think you need you need a woman in your life, right? What? Yes. Fred. You need to give relationship another chance, okay? No. Give love another chance. No, 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 no. That's not gonna work out. No, I can't. I'm not in the space. I'm not the I'm, I, it's not going to work out, no. I can't love another person. How do you know it will not work out if you don't at least try? Could you stop, please? At least respect the fact that Laura is here. Uh, all right. No problem, but I would definitely raise this matter another time. Whatever. This just was alcohol. What are you saying? Hmm? Do you know Laura is right there? What? Oh, it's fine. Hi, Tony. Yeah, that's Jesse. I'm done for today. I need to leave. Wow. Any improvement? Well, it's a gradual process. I mean, how long is this process going to take? It depends on the patient, okay? In similar cases of incomplete paraplegia, it takes quite some time. But I'm positive she'll be fine. <laughs> okay, I'm just worried. I mean, her healing process will help take my boss out of his current state of depression. I get it. I understand, but trust me, she'll be fine. Okay? Okay. Okay. So, I need to go. All right. Do See you some other time. Thank you. See you some other time. All right. Okay, let me get it though. Okay. Right, how far now? So, man, we don't. Alcohol and cigarettes again. Come on now. This is slowly becoming your lifestyle, and it is not good for you. 
Maybe it's the only companion I have left that helps me forget. You need to understand that this might help for a while. But I mean, at the end of the day, your worries will come back on you twice as heavy. Just let me be. I lost my wife. Freddy, you've mourned that enough already now. Uh -uh. You've mourned that enough already. And I need you to understand that. <laughs> yes, you lost a woman, right? But it is another woman that will fill that gap for you. I didn't just lose a woman. I lost my wife. My soulmate, my best friend, but just a woman. Okay. I understand that perfectly. All right? And I'm sorry about that. But I need you to stop drinking or smoking. I mean, you know the health hazard of smoking cigarette now. You of all people. That is exactly what your agency preaches against. And that's what you're doing. I'm tired, bro. I'm tired of everything. I'm tired. I'm exhausted. Hi. <laughs> Hello. Hello. How are you? I'm fine. You look so beautiful. Thank you. What's your name? My name is Hope and you. My name is Evans. Nice meeting you. Nice to meet you too. And you know what? Hope is actually a very beautiful name. Thank you. And that is exactly what I need right now. Why? You lost yours? Hmm. Not for me, for my friend. You must be joking. Well, I'm not. You know, I I feel he needs he needs to restore his life hope, or should I say, his hope for love. And I feel you can help with that. And he doesn't have the courage to talk to me by himself. No, 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 no. Please, please just hear me out, okay? I believe you have a change of heart by the time I'm done. Go on. Okay. Okay, it's time for you to play Angel. Okay. okay it's my turn now. Oh. Mm. Let's just assume I'm not seeing your games. I'm just playing for you, okay? Okay, for myself. Straight to the market. Ah. Okay, it's time for Angel to play. Laura needs star. Let's see how it goes. Oh, yes, I have it. Star it. And it's your turn. Hmm. And last card for Angel Laura. Okay, I play angle seven and Laura just won. <laughs> Congratulations. You're such an angel. <sighs> this world no balance. So why do bad things happen to good people? A smart and vibrant Laura, now confined to a wheelchair, not able to move or talk. God, help heal her. Evans, what's up, bro? Great. Well, I know you say you don't want this, but I cannot sit back and watch you destroy your own life. All right? 
So I'm sending a lady over tomorrow. What? I told you I don't want to see anybody right now. I'm not ready to see anybody. I don't want to see anybody. I told you this. I want you guys to talk and get to know each other. You're not hearing me. I just said that I don't want to see it. All they did is done. So you better be nice to her. Like I care. Listen, I don't appreciate you trying to control my life, okay? I'm a grown-up, okay? You're a friend, not my dad. Man, this is this is for your own good. What's up, man? How's the book going? Good? Good. You good? Do you want anything? All right. Ah. Um, good afternoon. Good afternoon. Please, my name is Hope. I'm here to see Mr. Fred. Mr. Fred. Just wait. Thank you. Hi. Um, please, I'm here to see Mr. Fred. Sorry, I don't understand. Is Mr. Fred around? <laughs> Why are you misbehaving with me? What's your problem? Is Mr. Fred around? Um, please, can you call your father for me, please? Fred! Hey! Fred! <sighs> Suit yourself. I could get you more books, you know? Oh, Hello? Yeah, no, sorry. I was, um... Uh, hi. I'm sorry I missed your calls. Where, um... Are you still coming today? I hate being embarrassed. What do you mean? What, what do you mean? Your daughter embarrassed me in your house. I left your house not quite long ago. How could my daughter possibly embarrass you? I mean, she's not talking right now. She blocked me at the entrance door. The worst part of it all is I was calling you and not answering your calls. Your phone was rather ringing at the parlor. I'm sorry. I'm sorry about that. Okay, I'll make it up to you. Where are you? 
I'm still in the neighborhood. I'm trying to get a taxi. No, no, no. Please, just come back. Okay, I'll make it up to you. I promise. It's fine. Thank you. I'm so sorry about that, okay? It's I look, fine. Yeah, you're so nice. Thank you for coming back. Um, please have a seat. Okay, Hope. This is my beautiful daughter, Laura. Laura, this is my friend, Hope. Okay, uh, so what would you like me to offer you? Anything is fine. Anything? Alcohol, non alcohol? Anything is fine. Okay, all right. I got you. I think this is actually nice. It's 1980 Spanish. Okay. Uh, okay, I see you. Yeah, you guys already met each other. Yeah, I met her earlier. Yeah. She seemed not to like me. She keeps giving me this mean look. Oh, no, no. Laura is not like that. Laura, Laura is a friendly person, right? Yeah, she's friendly. Um, okay, we could go upstairs if, if that makes you more comfortable. I think I'll prefer that. We need two of these. Um, okay, so... I'm just... Uh, we're going to talk upstairs. Okay? I should probably keep these next to you. You can change the channel if, you, if, if you're done with anything. But the book is nice. I'll get you more books. That's... What's wrong? Why are you looking at me like that? Come on. Hi. Can we leave already? Ah. Uh... I'm sorry, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. Hope, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry, I'm so, so sorry. I don't know, can we do this another time? Really? Yeah, I don't know. Uh, she's not feeling too well right now. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. It's fine. Yeah? It's fine. Okay. Thank you so much. Yeah, no, yeah, sure. Let me lock the door. I'll be back, okay? I've never seen this girl here before. Maybe my boss wants to employ a maid for Laura. Because he has been the one doing virtually everything for her. My boss is really going through a lot. Well, I just pray it works out well if that be the case. At least, that will help ease him of some stress. Sorry, my love. Sorry. Sorry. Sorry, baby. Sorry. Sorry. Down. Sorry. Sorry. 
sorry. I will also beg Tony to be helping you with the exercises, all right? Yeah. Sorry. 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 You crying? Oh, pretty girls don't cry, remember? Hmm? Sorry. Sorry, I just have to massage it to help the healing process, okay? It's okay. It's okay. <clears throat> I'll beg Tony to always assist you with your exercises, especially when I'm not around. Okay? Can I see that pretty smile? Hmm? Yeah, no, I'm, 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 um, 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 this is like the pregame, you know, it's my pregame ritual. Okay, it's fine, I'll wait. How did she even get here? She was downstairs when we were coming up. Could you please just stop? Could you leave, please? Could you not talk and just go? You shouldn't be on the floor. You should just talk to me. Hey, hey. You're supposed to be focused on our relationship, not what you have around you. Laura is not just something I have around me. She's my entire world. Her happiness is my priority. Just listen to yourself, Fred. <sighs> you know what? I can't do this anymore. What? No, what do you mean? This relationship or whatever this is, I can't do it anymore. And it's not you, it's me. You know, I mean, you're a beautiful, 
Wonderful, smart mm-hmm. girl. Okay. Yeah, Fred, how far? Hey, bro. Um, yeah, no, I'm good. I just wanted to tell you that I broke things off. Oh. I thought you said things were going well. What happened? Nah, it's not her. It's me. I don't just feel like there's any connection between us. You know? I told you it wasn't going to work out. I told you. And to top it all off, Laura doesn't even like her. So. Well, if it didn't work out with her, it doesn't mean it won't work out with someone else. I already told you. I don't want anyone else. I know you did. But I, I feel you do need someone, okay? You just don't know it. Just keep an open mind, huh? Open mind. Got it. Let's go now, okay? See uh, This guy. A while. Sweetie, so what do you want to have for lunch? Huh? Um, do you want rice and chicken? No? Okay. Rice and chicken and plantain. You went through like a phase of plantain that you love plantain. I don't know what happened. to eat okay so i'll go over the test again or you can tell me whatever you say do you want chinese food no oh okay 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 uh spaghetti is your favorite do you want do you want spaghetti do you want, do you want spaghetti Yes, that was a nod. I'm taking it. Yes. Yeah, I was surprised when you turned it down the first time. It's your favorite meal. Okay, great. Uh, I'll tell to- Tony. Antonio. Yes, boss. Uh huh. Bro, um, <laughs> Laura has made a request. Okay, she wants to eat spaghetti. Wow. Okay, so just get her spaghetti. Okay. All right. 
Get both of us for it, man. Just have, just have money. Yeah, I still have some money with me. I love your honesty. <laughs> Honestly. You're a good guy. You're my guy. Okay? Get for both of us, okay? Okay, And get whatever for yourself. All right, sir. Alright, boss, I'm back. You're back. Yeah. You got for only her. I guess she didn't have as much money as she thought. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's okay. It's okay. That's the most important thing that she gets her food. Okay. Please set this up on the table. Okay, sir. Thank you. All right. Tony, um, I'll be having a guest later on today, okay? Her name is Fina. Okay. So how do I get to know her? She'll identify herself, okay? And when she gets here, pay for her taxi. I'll okay. give you the money, I'll give you the money. Okay, so no problem. All right. All right. And we are done eating. You know, whenever you're done eating, I feel like I just finished eating as well. <laughs> do you want some water? Okay, juice is great, but you need water to balance it as well, okay? Just gonna keep it right there. <laughs> you still do that. <laughs> You've been doing that since you were a kid. You drink water on you. <laughs> That's a smile. I got you to smile. Don't hide it. Yes, that's a win for me, for us. <laughs> um, okay, it's time for your siesta, I guess. You don't want to sleep? Uh, you sure? Mm. <clears throat> Are you sure you don't want, you don't want to sleep? Hey. hey. <laughs> Hi. How you doing? I'm fine. That's I miss good. you. Yeah. How are you doing? I'm good. I missed you as well. Hi, Laura. How are you today? I thought she's supposed to be having a siesta by now. Uh, yeah, no, she's not sleepy. So, yeah. Okay, can we go upstairs? I'm um, actually watching a game. After the game, they're showing highlights though, so. Okay. Yeah. <sighs> uh, why is she looking at me like that? What do you mean? Why is she looking at me like she's possessed? It's just a question. Wait, what did you just say? Are you insulting my daughter in my presence? It's just a question. What kind of question is that? That's a stupid question. How could you ask me that? What? Could you stop? Could you, could you leave? Leave. Really? Yes, leave. Don't turn me into this guy. Please, just go. Could you just leave? Just go. Never meant for this to happen. My world is crashing down. I lost the one I love, and the one that is here is in so much pain. What can I do? I've tried all I could. Nothing seems to be working and it's breaking my heart. Oh, ooh, ooh, you okay? Ooh, yeah. Ooh, Trying to watch TV. Try to be strong, trying to be the right. man, but I'm losing my mind. I try to escape yeah. from everything happening, but it still stares me in the face. Try to be strong, trying to be the man, but I'm losing my mind. I try to escape from everything happening, but it's just there's me in my face. Careful, hold on. Okay. I'm losing my mind. So what can I do? I'm losing my mind. Tell me what can I do? Oh, shit. So. Let me have it. I'm 
Don't worry. Very soon, you'll take control of yourself. All right? It's, it's just a matter of time. Let's go inside. Hmm? Try to be strong, trying to be the man, but I'm losing my mind. I try to escape from everything happening, but it still stares me in the face. I try to be strong, trying to be the man, but I'm losing my mind. I try to escape from everything happening, but it still stares me in the face. Tell me what can I do? Never meant for this to happen My world is crashing down I lost the one I love And the one that is here is in so much pain What can I do? I've tried all I could Nothing seems to be working And it's breaking my heart sleeping don't tell me you're drunk again mm -hmm. no no i'm not drunk i was just breasting breast milk breast milk resting and i have been here waiting for you for the past one hour <sighs> why what kind of question is that have you forgotten that we are supposed to meet 4 p.m here today come this will be the third time you're doing this to me fred and so i was supposed to oh well, I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I forgot. So I'll make it up to you. I promise. I promise. Fine. Now, uh, what about Fina? She called me and told me what happened. What if I should told you is exactly what happened, bro? And you have not called her since then? <sighs> There's nothing to talk about, man. I can't get along with someone that doesn't get along with my daughter. Bro, I don't, I, I don't, I, I don't know what to do right now. Trust me. Don't say anything. We'll talk later, man. I need to go back soon. All right, no problem. Later. What's wrong with this young man now? Kind of. Tony. Yes. Please, I'd love to ask you for something. Okay, what is it? I want to know what Laura likes, like her hobby, you know, what she likes to do, stuff like that. Um, 
Laura likes ice creams. Oh, ice cream. Yeah, and again, she likes reading a lot. Things like novels and all that. Really? Yeah. Oh. Okay. Thank you. Okay. You're going? Yeah, sure, I'm leaving. All right. <laughs> bye. All right, bye. Just hope you like them. But first, um, let's start with the ice cream. Let's start with the ice cream. Yeah, I was thinking you don't like it. <laughs> I was thinking you don't like it. You like it, right? Why are you for me now? You were just for me, for me, right? <laughs> That's my girl. Swallow it now. You still have it in your mouth. No, it's Jesse. You're here? Yes. Mm. Good day. Good day. <laughs> I actually came to drop some gifts for Laura. Oh, that's yeah. so thoughtful of you. Thank you. Mm. But um, I'll be rushing out now because I have an emergency to attend to. Oh, okay. What of what of Fred? Um, he's in his room resting. Uh. He barely comes out whenever I'm around. And you know I can't leave Laura all to herself. Yeah. So as a matter of fact, I was just coming to see if I if I can find Tony. Don't oh. know if you did you see hey, yeah, him? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I saw him when I was coming in. He was stepping out, he said he had errands to run for Fred. Really? Yes. Oh. Yeah. Is he avoiding me? Why will he avoid you? I don't think so. I'll talk to him. I'll talk to him. I'll get to him, all right? And Laura is a safe house. You can, you can actually go. I'll take care of her. Okay, thank you. All right. Bye. Enjoy your day, okay? You too. Bye. <laughs> Bye. How are you? Mm, you're reading a book. Okay, let me see your dad upstairs, okay? All right. My world is crashing down I lost the one I love And the one that is here is in so much pain 
What can I do? I tried all I could. Nothing seems to be working, and it's breaking my heart. Oh. be the man right. but I'm losing my mind I try to escape from everything happening but it still stares me in the face I try to be strong trying to be the man but I'm losing my mind I try to escape from everything happening but it still stares me in the Laura yeah Tony yeah Please, I need you to see Fred. See Fred? Yes. What happened to him? Is it anything I know not of or just the usual? Well, I think this is more than the usual. I mean, everywhere is oozing in offensive, drunk smell of alcohol and cigarettes. Please see him. Not again. Well, I'll see him later. Laura is of what most concerned to me right now. Oh, how is she? <sighs> Just the way she has always been. All right, I'll leave them here, okay? But please, when you're done with her, just try and see, okay? Okay, thank you. Oh. I'll be on my way. All right. There's too much life. Oh my god. Please stand up and take your medication. You will drink yourself to death one day. Mm. We'll see about that. Uh. <sighs> Can you stop doing this to yourself? Mm. Flies, you know, all flies. Where's Jesse? She left earlier. Hmm? She has an emergency to attend to. What's about Laura? She is in her room sleeping. Okay. All right. Evans was here earlier, but you couldn't talk to him, so he left. Huh? Evans was here earlier, hmm. but you couldn't talk to him, so he left. I couldn't, I was sleeping now. I mean, you're going to just help me out, Flies. What's up, beautiful? And, and smoking isn't you you're supposed to 
be my role model. You're supposed to be taking care of me, but how would you even take care of me if you can't even take care of yourself? I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. You can walk. You can talk. When did this happen? Stop crying, please. Please, 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 please stop crying. When did you start walking and talking? Please stop crying. Please, please, please. It's okay. It's okay. Jesse and... Jesse and Tony helped me. Yeah, it was a really painful process, but he insisted that I had to do the exercise every time. Oh, just relax, okay? Wait, hold it. Just hold it. Oh! Yeah. Hold it. Careful, careful. Don't worry, you. Just hold on. Hold on. Good, hold it here. Hold it tight. Okay? You can do this. Okay? You can. just wished that you would be there, but, but it didn't happen. I remember when I talked for the first time. <laughs> I wish she called my daughter quite often. She bought him cakes and gave. and talk. I can't let my father know of this. His actions keep hurting me. At that point, I, I decided that I wasn't going to tell you anything about it. I, the height of it was when I was able to walk for the first time without my, without my crutches. I try to escape from everything happening, but it's just there is me in the face. I 
everything happening, but it's just there is me in my face. Tell me what can I do? I'm so sorry. My love, I'm sorry. Okay, I was irresponsible. I should have been there for these moments. I'm so sorry. No more drinking. No more smoking. It's done. Okay, this is done. That's it. It's gone. No more drinking for you. You're my world. You're my entire world. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I'm guessing you that car. I meant it. I love you so much. Remember how I told you that my technique for eating chicken with is in like you split it like that way of life. I feel like my happiness is restored. Everything is so much better. The sun shines brighter. I'm happy you're happy. Sorry. Yes, sir. I owe you big time. Honestly, you're a good guy. I owe you. You owe me nothing, boss. I only paid back for the goodness you've shown me all these years. I mean, you're, you're second to none. And I am happy to be of service. He has his speech ready. <laughs> you know, he has his speech ready. My guy, my no. guy. I see what you do. Thank you, sir. I got you. Thank, Thank you, darling. Well, he's ready. Mm. Yes, please. Yes, please. All right. Let me let you know. Now, when you when you turn twenty four, promise me you will still be wearing this type of clothes. <laughs> 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 I'll carry okay, shotgun and find all those boys. So, so you better stay my princess for life. You should bring your phone. Let me check. Because I'll come and find all those boys. Okay, take my phone. What do you think of? I don't have your pen now. I don't have your pen. Okay, let's do this. <laughs> <laughs> Laura, I must say it feels really good to see you back on your feet again. I mean, this is one moment I really prayed for. Seeing your dad get back on the streets. Yeah. I mean, it's really not easy for a really kind-hearted man to lose his wife. Mm. And then almost his daughter. That's true. Well, at least you both of you are fine now. So, hope you've got the glory. Yeah, we are. Mm -hmm. But then, there's one more thing remaining. What was that? Oh, no, don't worry. My dad will let you know when it's time. Why not tell me yourself? Okay. All right. I'll wait for your dad. Okay? Okay, so I'll see you tomorrow. All right? Okay. Take good care of yourself. All right? Eat well. Hmm? Mm, yes, sir. Right. <laughs> well, I'll see you. Bye. Thank you.
Tony. Yeah. Thank God you are here. What's going on? What's happening? I really don't get this question. Fred called me last night. All right, he said I should come. I called him back because I wasn't comfortable with the way he was sounding. Right? I asked him what the problem was. He said nothing. But I don't believe him because he sounded somehow on the phone. Please talk to me. What is going on? Um, anyway, um, Jesse, you will only know better when you get into the house. Travel. I'm sorry, I didn't inform you on time. Yeah, it's all. Yes, right. Jeez. Baby, I'm so happy for you. I mean, how did it happen? Hi. You were right. Things do change. How did it happen? It's a long story. I have all the time in the world. Come to me. Jeez. Come, 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 please, please. I want to hear it. I missed that. Well, some people who were present here also missed it. So don't beat yourself up, okay? Oh, come on, this guy. <laughs> you know, um, Jesse, I never knew one could miss what he never had. What's going on? You haven't put it back. Uh, yes. We took out our portrait. That's my wife's portrait, okay? Your late wife. Technically, yes, but she's still my wife, right? So put it back. Mm. Dad, I know you're better now, but there's one thing remaining. There's one thing remaining. Mm -hmm. What's that? I need a stepmom. And I know that you also need a woman by your side. Do you understand what you're saying right now? Yes, that I do. And I know you don't have anyone in mind, but I do. <laughs> okay, and who's that? Auntie Jessie. And I know you like her too. Mm-hmm. 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 Like her. Crazy. Until I met you. And this time I'm not willing to let go. Because my heart longs for you. And the best part is that Laura approves of this. Really? <laughs> she did that? Yeah, and I'm willing to give you time, you know, if that's what you need to process everything, take it step, you know. <laughs> we, we don't need that time. I mean, I, I like you too. I've always liked you. Thank you, Princess. Thank you. Look at you, you're looking all beautiful. You can walk now, right? <laughs> Look at you. <laughs> you marry me. Hmm? Say yes. Say yes. Yes. I'll always be there for you. Whenever you need me or want me. Yeah. <laughs>
I'll marry you. <laughs> My man. <laughs> Bro.